Starting off tonight in Orangeburg County, that's where pet owners are now required to register their cats and dogs. Yeah, the move is meant to help owners find their pets if they become lost. News 19's Victoria Samuels has the details. I think it's a great law. Um, I think it's long in coming. I, I, you know, I, I think it's been needed for a long time. Orangeburg County residents that live outside of city limits are required to register their pets with the county animal control. The ordinance requires cat and dog owners to pay $50 if their pet is vaccinated but isn't spayed or neutered. But that fee drops to $1 a year if the pet has been fixed. Jasmine Quarles is the manager at Orangeburg County Animal Control and says the goal of this ordinance is to reunite pets pet owners with their animals in case they get lost. And the primary goal of this is to be able to reunite pets with their owners if they're lost or if they're at large or if they get out accidentally. It's a quicker turnaround for us to get those animals out of the shelter so that we can focus on the stray population that don't have owners or that don't have homes. And right now, I would say a majority of these animals that come into the shelter are probably owned by people, but they don't have a way to be identified. Colleen Dadisman lives in Nieces and registered her two cats and dogs with the county. She says this is something needed in the community. I just think that it's something that everyone should do and be encouraged to do, be happy to do, to help with the um, animals in their area where you live. And there's a lot of complaints about the animals, but nothing's being done. And I see this as a way to help. Quarrel says if a pet owner loses their dog or cat, having them registered gives them more time to reclaim them at animal control before they are adopted or sent to a rescue shelter. If we can't identify the animal, then we hold it for five days, which is our five day stray hold. And we hold it at the shelter to give time for someone to come and claim it as their own pet. And if no one comes forward within those five days, then the animal is put on our page or it's going to go to a rescue or it can be adopted out if that's an option. But if it is owned by somebody such as a tag, rabies tag or something like that that helps identify the animal to an owner, then we hold it for 21 days for that person to be able to come reclaim the animal. Pet owners who violate this requirement can face a ticket up to $250. For Street Squad Orangeburg, Victoria Samuels, News 19, WLTX. And pet licensing will be available in Nieces on Mondays, Hilton Head on Thursdays from 1 until 5.